Greetings and welcome to Graveyard Keeper. I'm Catherine of Sky, and we have many things to do on this foggy, foggy day. <laughs> oh my god, what is all this fog around here? Okay, so we have a number of things that we need to accomplish. Oh my god, look at how much. Oi, oi, that's so bad. Uh, all of these actions take so much energy. Look at this two bushes and we're like already a quarter of the energy down so what we want to look at first of all is we want to look at uh, getting some iron tools mostly because uh, they're going to save us energy in the long run so we're going to look at primitive forging first uh, we also want to probably get some sewing done so that we can get flitches uh, i don't know what's used in the oven for um fuel last time it was okay we can get firewood uh, coal or sticks and we can um, make stuff we can make bread right now and stuff okay effect on use plus 12 happy days are here again and of course someone mentioned that there are recipes now in the cookery tab which is really nice it's kind of cool so let's get started oh my gosh there's so much to do okay um yeah can we get rid of these stones let's see if we can get rid of these so we can place down some of our first things that we're going to need. Okay, so we can make a, a box. We have one box there. Uh, let's see, a furnace would be a really good start. We don't have enough simple iron parts. We need to just go into our um, basement and harvest some of these things here. Oh my gosh, it's so dark. Okay, there's some parts there. I forgot, did we go back to our friend? Oh, it gives us a free thing. Recipe, simple and tasty, how nice. Can I use that? Let's see. Uh, whoopsies, it's inventory, there we go. Use. All right, baked mushrooms and baked apples. That sounds really good. All right, let's see what we can do with that. Ah, we have some, some flour. Looks like they're gonna let us make some bread, I'm thinking. Just go ahead and collect all the things here. And we may have to just go to sleep at some point. Oh, we get some extra. We have uh, some things. Let's see. Let's see what we can do. Technologies here. Can we? Yes, we can go into primitive forging. Yes, unlock. And then we'll want to get tools. So that's going to be 20 um, energy for or 20 red uh, tech points for that. Sewing. Can we get this? Uh, wood billet here's the firewood we need so we don't have to rely on sticks so we're going to need a lot more red points for now but that's okay we have all of these actions to do which will get us there and we're out of energy <laughs> already <laughs> that's nice they give you a chest there uh to begin with all right can we do anything here let's see oh and somebody mentioned that if you mouse over the thing on the left oh there it is, says effect on use here uh, and this is how much energy it takes to craft it. Uh, but still, it's, um, yeah, berry juice, obviously we can't use right now. It's probably a component of something else. Uh, we can make dough, though. And to make bread, we probably need dough. Let's see. We can make, um, let's see, two dough to two bread, which is okay. Uh, ooh, that's pretty good. But it's costing much, a lot of energy there, man. All right. We have no energy, so we need to sleep. Let's go. Oh, let's see. We have a corpse to process. I'm so refreshed. <laughs> really? You've only slept like five minutes and you're so refreshed. <laughs> oh, dear. Okay. Well, I don't know if we even have enough. Um... You know what we could do? is we could just bury the guy without disrupting him at all. Uh, yeah, maybe that's a better idea. Just stick him in the ground and then we'll process him later. Oh, whoops, can I pick him up? There we go. Okay, cool. Hey, great deal. Didn't even have to work hard on him. <laughs> go to sleep we got the certificate I mean you know 
It works. It works. It's a thing. Let's go to sleep. It's nighttime. We can use the rest. Get our energy back up. All right. I hope we're dreaming sweet dreams. Like really nice dreams. That would be good. I'm so refreshed. Right. Uh, okay. So what do we got? I wish that... Okay. So one thing I really wish that if the devs are still listening, I would wish that it shows the tech points at all times. That they were persistent. Like, because I want to see what action I need to do without having to do an action to see it. I mean, I know I can open up the, uh, the inventory menu or the tech menu, but it's kind of like, eh, I'd really rather just do other things. Okay, I think I want to go also and get some ore. Okay. Let's see what we got. We should get that farming thing going as well. All right, for a furnace, we're going to need lots more stone. We need flitches and we need simple iron parts. Did we? Okay, let's go look in the basement. I think we still had a couple of thingy things left. There we go. Some of these kind of destroyed barrels. Okay, there's our last iron part that we needed. I hope there's some other nice tasty stuff in here. We need at least 20 points, I think, to unlock those uh, those tools. So just go up and uh, deal with this stuff. All right, so we have, what do we have actually right now? Inventory. All right, we've got our mug of beer. We've got our tools that we're using, berries. Uh, burial certificate, one once stone. You know, what? I'm going to put some stuff in here. I think uh, that can stay out. But the sticks can go there too. Um, I kind of want to use up, I'll use up those, um, the repair kits. I think that would be a really good idea just to get them out of our inventory and also repair stuff, which um, has a better benefit for us, of course. I forgot how many I have of each. We'll see. But let's see what we can do here. E, grave, yes. Fix, good. Yeah, quality minus 19. That is not ideal. Definitely not ideal. Wooden grave fence. Okay. It only uses one to repair. <clears throat> Excuse me. And then this is a fence that will also take one to repair. Perfect. And then we'll have used up our things and we'll have improved our score a little bit. Okay, good. It is good. Very, very good. Wait, is this one not finished crafting? Not quite sure which... Oh, it's this one. Oh, nice. Okay, get some more points here. I'll take it. Cool. Looking good. Looking much better, in fact. I think that's what I'm going to do. I think I'm just going to chuck bodies in, in the ground for now since... We know there's not much else we can do with this stuff. Um, let, let me eat something. Wow, berries eating plain is not ideal. Oh well. You okay? I'll just use as much as many berries as I need to um, refill on health. Okay, so just E, F. Here we go. Oh my god. Look at this. <laughs> Wonderful. Ugh. All right. I think if we put the body on the table in the morgue, then it won't decay, if I remember correctly. It's been a few months since I've played this game, or at least a month. I don't remember. Um, in any case, I've had many things happen in between, so please forgive me if I don't remember everything correctly. Uh, we're still kind of getting there. All right. Let's go. Go to our house, rest, sleepity sleep. Kind of wish you could hurry up the timing or something like that. Tech, can we, oh, can we open the tech window while we're sleeping? No, of course not. We have to sit, That that's one thing that I wish was different, that you could, um, you could do things while you were sleeping or hurry the sleeping or something, um, make it, available to us that we can do other things uh, instead of just waiting for all disease to happen. Okay, so we did this. We looked at this. We can go and collect. That was funny. <laughs> I pressed F and he walked all the way around all on his own. That was very funny. Okay. 
probably also going to need some logs. Uh, I want to get this unlocked, too. Did we... I forgot if we talk... All right, next time we go into the morgue, we'll talk to our friend. Oh, okay. What's going on now? Everything is ready, Monsignor. Good. Were there problems? No, Monsignor. Except there was a strange fella snooping around. Oh, there he is. Halt. Guys, calm down. I live here at the graveyard. He calls us guys? Why, he's a cultist for certain, Monsignor. <laughs> oh, dear. I'm the graveyard keeper. I work as the keeper of the local graveyard. You can ask any of the villagers about me. Then you're definitely a new one. I feel you're telling the truth. Would you join me at the witch burning ceremony? I hate this. Okay, we'll go. It would be my honor. So how did you find yourself in such an interesting position? Um, let's dodge the question. Well, it just happened. There's nothing special to say. You're definitely hiding something, and I'll find out what. Oh, I forgot about this pit. Here I am, the Great Inquisitor. I protect the one true faith and humankind itself. We're having a tough time in the town. The ship of the dead is already overloaded, and there's a new one stuck in the shipyard. See, everybody who's complaining about the donkey killing people... Th no, there are people coming in on a ship. Uh, your graveyard is opening again at a suspiciously auspicious time. The dark cult is rising. I can feel it. Righteous anger rises in it with my soul. We haven't revealed a witch for a long time, and now we're lighting up the second one this year. Oh god, that poor person. And it's only the beginning. This is like horrible. Really horrible. I hate this bit. I really hate this bit. This is not friendly. Like, I totally empathize with the person that this is- they're just deleting here. Horribly. Oh god, that hurts. Oi. Yeah, this is just awful. Just awful, awful, awful. Alright. Uh, you live right beside the hill near the graveyard, that right? Yes. Interesting, interesting. You know, I need someone to be my friend here at the village. A friend of mine is a friend of the Holy Inquisition. Villagers are different from us town citizens. You can't trust them. But you're new here. You might notice something unusual. I hate this. I'm trying to go as, as fast as I can. Yeah, we'll agree. Yes, yes, yes. To earn my trust. You have to show your goodwill. Tasks. Yes. Okay. I hate this. I absolutely hate this. We can talk next uh, sort of Mars Day. All right. Let's go. Let's go. Out, out, out. Leave. Oh, I absolutely hate that. Like, that's so awful. Um, okay, so we're going to go to the village and see about getting the farm unlocked, uh, since we know about that. I'm not going to use dash here because I have so little energy. Wait, can I pick these mushrooms? I can. Oh, they're on, they're locked, actually. That's so funny that I... It shows that you can harvest them, but there's a little tiny lock there. That's very handy. We'll also turn in the other burial certificate. And we'll go, there we are. Okay, so let's go up here, go to the, the bar here. That's where we need to ask about the farm anyway. It's good you know how to use a sword. Kresvold told me you, how you helped him. Here, have a beer, it's on the house. Okay, so we got a beer, how nice. So we didn't need to buy one. Um, okay, let's ask about the garden. I found an abandoned garden near the graveyard. Can you tell me anything about it? Oh, the garden. It was seized by the merchants to cover someone's debts. I can't find anyone who will make any use of it. Hmm, I can give you permission to use the garden. Who else would grow crops near the graveyard? All right, good. Uh, let's... Okay, keep listening. Good, but you still need to talk to the merchant. It's his property. It's not exactly proper to give you permission without his approval, but it'll be fine if you promise to settle the details with him later. Sure, I'll talk to him. Okay, next thing. He comes to trade with the locals every uh, tourist day. Uh, not tourist day, that's quake day, I think. He owns the barn just south of the tavern. Uh, okay, so let's trade with him. Give him our burial certificate. All right, so we do have... <laughs> let's see which one the skeleton wants. I don't know which one he'll want. But yeah, uh, also these guys can do give us energy. So we didn't totally waste the purchase. It's fine. Let's just go down there and i forgot to sharpen my shovel alas ooh, 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 ooh. let's gather all of these berries can i please there we go the other one didn't want to gather quite i think we're getting a lot of berries from these maybe i don't know if it's like 
they changed the drop rate, but it seems like more than before. I don't know. It's all good, though. Okay, so we got that stuff. Let's see if there's anything we need. Trade. Did we decide that buying a new shovel is cheaper than... Uh, or it's the same price. I think it's actually slightly cheaper because we can sell this one back. And we can buy this one. Okay, let's just do this. Right. Yep. Okay. Uh, good deal. So hopefully we'll <laughs> we'll get a chance to buy another shovel later. Otherwise, we're gonna have to learn earn a lot of silver. Okay. We will go back to the farm. Maybe we'll stop and get some seeds. Apparently, I'm told by Dutch Duke. Thank you very much for uh, for this insight. We need some carrots before we open the church. So um, something about opening the church, we'll need the carrots afterwards or something. So we will go ahead and buy them if we can afford them here, some seeds. All right, whatever you're selling, I'm not buying, even if it's drugs or magic elixirs. I'm just looking around, but I don't know what's happening, but everyone keeps telling me that I'm the graveyard keeper. Oh, then you're even worse than those shifty traveling merchants. I must say your whole profession is a fraud and I don't like you. Now that I've made my position clear, we can do business. <laughs> Yes. You told me about farming. Okay, is there anything special I need to know? You need to know how to fertilize the soil and then be ready for hard work. Honestly, you don't look much like a farmer. You're better off buying a pro from a professional like me. Mm -hmm. Even someone like you could cook something nice with my vegetables. Cool. We got ca oh carrot cutlet, bowl of sauerkraut. Oh, these are new. I don't remember seeing these before. All right. Can we buy any seeds? We, need we have wheat seeds, carrot seeds, and cabbage seeds. So we'll buy some of these. Let's buy four of each. Just really keep the money low because we don't have much money at all. Okay, there we go. Cabbage seeds as well. We'll just buy all of them. Okay, and it's going to cost us one silver eight. What do we got? Beets. Oh, beet seeds there are. And then some flour he's selling us too. Let's just buy the beet seeds. We need multiples of four. Oh, why can't I buy this? Oh, I have too many things in my inventory. Crap. Um, let's take out the beets. Yeah, take them all out. Okay, good. We'll just buy these for now. I've got to remember to clear out the inventory before we come back. Oh, look at that coal mine. That's tasty. I hope we can get to some of the other areas that we were not able to access before. Um, I'm going to go up here and see what this guy has. We know it's the wheat miller guy but we haven't seen if he does anything now. Greetings, the mill is broken, sorry. If you need something milled, you better go to the town. That's too bad, but I have nothing to mill. I live at the graveyard. Keeper, nice to meet you. I have some old reserves you may find, find useful. Uh, trade, okay. So we can buy flour from him if we want to. Okay. All right, let's go down here. Let's walk through the fields. All right, and get back home. We need to do some physical labor to get our red uh, science points up. I keep I keep wondering, like, what the heck to call them. Science points, tech points, energy, red energy points, <laughs> whatever they're called. Not sure exactly. Okay, here we go. Let's claim the property, and then let's do an empty garden bed. I think we'll... Oh, is this not available to us? I thought that was available last time. Anyway, it's okay. We're going to put these plots here. Can we fit them exactly? One, two, three, and then one, two, three. Yes, they can all be fitting perfectly, exactly, nicely. We don't need this many, but uh, we'll just put them down anyway. Okay. Oh, no, I don't want to remove. Let's just go out. This will count, hopefully, as physical labor. Boom. Now we have nothing to fertilize them with yet, but hopefully later we can make a compost heap and get some basic fertilization going. I think that's probably in the tech. Where is this farming? That would be okay. Ooh, look at this. We have a place for the berry bush and apple trees pl transplanting. This looks really nice. Gardening. Here we have perk farmer uh, and prayers for that decay. We might, you know what? We're going to get this. We are absolutely going to get this so we can get a compost heap going on here. In the meantime, I'm just going to do some basic, basic work here, getting these guys. Wait, I didn't get any points for those. 
Well, well then. That's not nice. I thought I would get some um, uh, energy point or tech points for those. Anyway, it's okay. So compost heap is going to cost us 20 sticks. Do we, did I put my sticks up in the chest? I might've done so. I think I might've done that. Man, it's so dark around here. I hope we can buy like lanterns or something. All right. I do have enough money to bury that body too. All right, let's make our compost heap over here. Okay, good. We'll build it. So we can just chuck the um, the vegetable waste matter into this heap next time we go farming. Okay, don't have enough of that yet. We still need at least 10 red points for the next process, which I kind of forgot what it was. Let's see what we can do here. Let's just take the body off the table. Um, yeah. Oh, hey, that's nice. Man, I was annoyed when it was like chucking it on the floor every time. <laughs> I'm glad you can now just like lift it right off the table. That's pretty handy. Um, let's see. Put this body here. Oopsies. Come on. Nope. 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 I really, really want to pick up this body. E. Oh, I was pressing F. I'm not quite sure why there are two different buttons, E and F, to do stuff. They they uh, perform similar functions. So it's like why? But it's okay. It's all good. We're going to get used to it again. I just kind of forgot. All right. No more energy. Let's go. It's moon day. All right. Or Lundi. Tuesday. As I think. Yep. Of course, coming from Lunar. All right. Let's go. Sleep. See if we can get some decent sleeping done. Yeah, this needs to have some kind of, like, there's no point to this. <laughs> I guess you could wake up technically at a time that you wanted to, maybe. Maybe that's the, the whole reasoning behind that. But we do need some, 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 uh, let's get some logs going on. We need firewood. Oh, all right. Those are too big of a tree to chop down. We've got to chop down the smaller ones. Okay, let's dig the stump as well. Okay, and then we're going to just kind of batch process all of this if we can. Okay, can I, where's the log? There it is. Just kind of like put these together. I like how you can just keep holding F so that you can get the stump going. And remember, you do need to dig up the stumps, stumps if you want to your, your trees to respawn or grow again. <laughs> they grow from saplings. But you also get some extra energy or tech points from all of this process. So it's kind of worth it just for that, I guess. Oh my god, no, donkey, I don't want another body yet. All right. Put the body on the table. I do not have enough points to bury this body so we're just going to put it here let it cool i don't think it decays when it's on the table so this will be a good thing to leave it there for now can we still juggle these things yes we can boom it seems to be even improved hooray okay let's just push to the side push them all to the side and then just oopsies you got out of alignment there, dude. Logs. It's nice though that like there are some actions like putting the logs in which do not take energy. That helps a little bit with stuff. And for anyone new to the game, and I know a lot of people are just returning to see where it's, what's going to go on in this game. But if you're new to the game, you need to put your logs and gigantic pieces of stone in here. Uh, logs, and, and they'll be automatically sort of shuffled to the machines that need them. Like when we make firewood, it'll just automatically draw from that pile instead of having to have it in our inventory. So that's what the um, that's why we put them in those particular areas. Um, so hopefully we'll get some of that firewood done. Let's see what we got tech wise. Okay. Point wise, we have 18 of these points. Um, smithing, we need our tools. So we need 20 there. Firewood. <laughs> 
We could really use the firewood. Let's get the firewood. Uh, and then we'll get the iron tools next. I want to be able to cook food. That's mostly the reason I'm doing this. So um, we need to build the thingy to chop the firewood. And we need to also build a furnace. We need our flitches. So let's see what we need. We can also build a wooden anvil. Uh, but first of all, we do need the... Ch oh, I, th I guess we need the sawhorse? Maybe we need a sawhorse. Because we can't build a ch chopping spot without having a wood billet. All right. There's many, many things here. I need some sticks. Let's get sticks first. But the good thing is in doing all this, we'll be able to get some materials and also get our points up. I forgot how many sticks we needed. I think we need we have enough now to build that one item. But we do need a lot of stone for that furnace too. Oh, our crops are growing nicely. Cool. Get these sticks out of here. Okay, good. All right, let's see what we can build. All right, we have our, let's see, we can build a sawhorse. We can rotate this. No, we cannot rotate this. Um, do we want it here? Or do we want, I think I want an anvil here. I can't remember where I put other things. No. <laughs> Uh, okay, let's put the sawhorse up here, and then the chopping spot can be below it. I think that's what we want. I for, I've completely forgotten where where we want to do what thing. I think this slices the logs into other pieces. Okay, there we go. We can also make our wooden marker here. All right, let's build our wood billets. We need at least one of those. And we'll also make some flitches. This is what I was talking about, about the um, the logs automatically being available. That's what we're doing right now is sawing up the raw logs and you can see they're, they're taken from the pile every time we use one. Uh, okay, so let's go and see the, okay, we need our wooden anvil. Okay, right, yes, yes. We'll put that here. And then we'll have our, we need a chopping spot. So we need four more wood billets. <laughs> like that's ever going to happen. Uh -huh. All right, we're going to need some iron bars. So we need the furnace to have those. Yet we're not enough energy. Let's go, go and, uh, oh, but you saw how it took the log. There were like only two logs left. And before I started the process, there were three. Sleepy time. Okay. <clears throat> All right. It is Venus Day today. <clears throat> I'm not going to see the singer today. Uh, there's no point to it. The the stuff with the pendant and snake, that's kind of like at least mid-game, if not end-game stuff. So that's really not going to be useful to us until then. So I'd rather stay home and do the work here. Uh, and get, oh, look, 16 red points. That's great. All right, chopping spot we need also. I think we can put this here. Yeah, I think that's okay there. And then we need to build a furnace next. So we need iron parts and we need stone. Okay. Uh, you know what? I'm going to process that body too, just so we can get some more money. Let's just take it to the graveyard, put it in. This is good that I can actually carry the body now. This is so good. Uh, instead of like chucking it on the floor, like this anger management issues here. Um, geez. Okay, there we go. Put it in. No, 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 E, E, there we go. Got my keys a little bit messed up there. Yep, we can go ahead and dig a couple more too. The graveyard score is really not going to matter until we are um, actually close to, to getting better here. Our shovel has broken. This is not great. I'm not going to go to town. I'm going to use the whetstone to fix this, I think. 
because I don't want to deal with this right now. But yeah, going to town and getting other stuff is going to be better for us. Let's go and put, put some stuff in here. We have two burial certificates that we can sell. We can, let's see. Oh, we have an exhumation permission. Cool. All right, we'll keep that. And I keep forgetting to give the beer. Let's go just give the, you know what? Next time the donkey arrives, we'll give the beer. <laughs> it's like, I don't want to make that trip. No. Okay, what can we do here? We can make some food of some kind. Let's get dough. Let's, uh, we need to go to the well and get the water. I wonder if they changed the water stuff at all. Because that was interesting, the way the water was last time. We have a bucket of clear water. Now, does it tell us it needs drops or buckets? Let's see. I think it was drops. Yeah, there we go. Okay, so to get the water organized, you need to put the water, the bucket on your hot bar, press two or whatever area. We got 20 water from this and then you can cook. Okay, it's kind of an odd thing, but yeah, I guess it works. Now let's shove this stuff in the oven. Uh, okay, good. We can make these guys, but we have no fire. We have no firewood because I forgot to make firewood. Okay, let's figure out what do we need for firewood. Uh, okay, we need some of these guys. So those um, billets. I, I won't have enough energy to do this. I need to start eating flowers or something. I wonder if we have enough uh, berries to make muffins. <laughs> muffins, the food of choice. In any case, this seems like a good... Uh, time to stop because otherwise we're gonna have another day and it's gonna be another 10 minutes and that will make the episode way too long so anyway thank you so very much for joining me take care of yourselves and each other and I'll see you next time